All right, and we are here with uh, me and Usman, Usman of uh, Wakefield Cast Castro, right? How are we doing? Doing good, doing good. It's a, it's a great show today. So is this your first time to Expo Cam? Uh, the first time to Expo Cam here in Quebec. Uh, otherwise, they have their version of the Expo in Ontario. So we're, we're very active participants. Right. And what's changed with Castro? Now, I drove for 25 years. Oil and all that is always part of every truck driver's life. Uh, is there some new products you guys are launching? Or? No, absolutely. We have a wide range of products and uh, we've been in the business for as long as you've been in the <laughs> business. Too long. Uh, too long. And so we've got a lot of, uh, you know, technology backing our products because that's really uh, where we try to benchmark versus our competitors. Right, right. So our lubricants uh, fulfill the requirements of what is required in Canada, keeping the climate and conditions uh, in mind as well. So, yes. Is there anything owner operators should be looking for at this time of year when we're changing from winter to spring? I know it doesn't go directly winter, spring. It goes winter, right. spring, winter, winter, back to spring. Is there something they should be looking for in, when choosing lubricants and stuff like that? Absolutely. Uh, for owner drivers, it's not just about lubricants. It's also about greases. And temperature changes can affect the, the performance of lubricants and greases. So they will need to uh, possibly change uh, depending on the temperatures. So uh, winters will generally see, uh, sorry, summers will uh, generally see products like 1540 uh, viscosity grades uh, come out. In addition, the most important thing to keep in mind is greases because there you actually do see a shift uh, in the types of greases that one purchases between winter and summer. So they'll uh, generally do that as well. Now, a lot of the lubricants have been changing over the years. You know, us old school truckers, it was every, you know, 15,000 or whatever you change your oil. And now they're really extending that. Is that something we can trust? Because a lot of people are still not sure, right? No, it's absolutely something that, that the industry is pushing at. Yeah. And I would say that Castrol is, is definitely uh, in, in the range, one of the highest ranges that you can actually offer. So our lubricants, you can change at about 125,000 upwards kilometers, one of our best lubricants. And that is significant savings for our consumer. In addition, we offer services like loop check, uh, which, uh, or lap check as we call it, and that's really to check the performance of your lubricant. So not only are we just claiming this, but we're also ensuring and providing services for you to check along the way. Wow, that's got to save owner operators a ton of money not having to change the oil as much or, you know, all some of these uh, specialty uh, pieces, uh, ingredients that you have that are helping to really improve performance. Yes, it is. Yeah, at the end of the day, it's all about the bottom line. Yeah. And, it's, and, and it even goes beyond just owner drivers. When we talk about large fleets of companies, uh, there is significant savings. The minute you go from you know, conventional oils right now will change at 60,000 kilometers. Imagine you doubling that. Yeah. So if you're changing, you know, if you're changing oil 15 times a year, you're down to six or seven. That is a significant saving. That's right. So where can people go to learn more about Castrol and all the different changes? You have? So you can go visit our website, castrol.ca, uh, and you will find significant uh, information there. You can also uh, go to our distributors and dealers. You will find uh, information about them on our website. That's probably the quickest way for you to find information about us. Or they can wait till next year and see you in Truck World or Expo Camp, whichever one we're on. Right? We will. We will definitely be there, and, and I and I look forward to them coming to our booth. Great. Thank you, man. Thank you very Thank much. You it was so a pleasure much. talking to you today. Thank you.